Well, one final comment for me from watching the 400 pictures and reading your story and all. From the pictures in particular, it seemed like uh, you guys knew how to throw good parties. That we did. Very family oriented. Yes, I was going to say they were family and oriented. It looked like they had a good oh. time. We, they did, and the food was fantastic. Even the cook prepared it. And uh, but I, I don't remember ever finding somebody drunk and laying on the ground or anything like that. Do you? I, it was free beer. That's fine. Um, those pictures. <laughs> those pictures. It's you can tell it was a different time because the hairstyles oh, were different. Know. The shorts that even good. the guys wore were much Short. shorter than they are today rather than these things that are halfway down your legs or whatever. And there was a lot of Miller Lite that seemed to show up in those pictures. Miller beer was part of Philip Morris. <laughs> yeah, that's why yeah, there that's was a why. lot of Miller Lite that, yeah, but, uh, that seemed to show up in those pictures. Yeah, I didn't get that beer, connection. Uh, um, became I a was, very good friend of the company. I, and I was amused by the pictures of the kids with what appeared to be a Holding on to the back legs of the pig. Oh, that was our, yeah, that was our, remember we had the, the grease, grease pig, pig contest. The grease pig contest. Yeah. The pig contest. Tell me about that. Well, we'd grease them up and then kids would have to catch them. Catch them. And it wasn't just age. kids, wasn't it adults? And adults. Management well, too? We did both, I think. I, 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 I saw some management pictures, looked like they were Steve eyeing these pigs. I would like, lower myself. To be oh, no, but you rode the tricycle, remember? <laughs> oh, oh, I lost. Right out, right out here, by the way. It was all rigged. Oh. Jack Robb rigged it. My he bicycle didn't. Work. He didn't. Yes, he did. He rigged it. My, my bicycle wouldn't work. <laughs> we, we had a fun time. We did. We, uh, we did. So, Donna, thank you for sharing all those oh, pictures. They gave me um, an insight of really what <laughs> sounds like you have an incredible company oriented. Thank you. Orientation, I, and obviously we've lived and we live in this community now and um, benefit from the, the fruits of all of your collective efforts. Well, that's thank you. For and I wanted to reason. thank you on behalf of the Historical Society for spending a couple hours with us today and well, regaling us with some of the stories. Particular about your people that. <laughs> Well, you some wait. things can't be helped. You you <laughs> Don't you know you're loved? Huh? Yeah. Don't you? Yeah, I know. Okay. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to give you the final, the final word. I, I appreciate you giving me the time to talk, and I could keep talking, as you know, probably for another 7 or 12 hours. <laughs> you know, there are, are so many things, the historical society, uh, what happened to the cheese ranch, problems we had with that, and, and uh, the groups that we thought we were building this underground city, and, and uh, I, I, it's so many funny things, you know, that you never would think would be a part of a, a development project, but uh, so many things affected so many of the residents, and, and the people enjoy living in these places, they enjoy a mission, and um, they're running out of money and want to expand the big pool at Mission. They need about a million four. So they're looking to you for that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, we're going to have so to shut this so off. Nice. Uh, thank, thank you. you. Not too hard. And I got to walk home now? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>